This year, December the 21st, is the winter solstice in the Northern Hemisphere, where we are. It's sometimes referred to as the shortest day, but what exactly does that mean? Well, it's all related to the Earth rotating around the Sun and the tilt of its axis. Here's the Earth orbiting around the Sun, and one whole rotation takes 365 days, one year. At the same time, the Earth is spinning on its own axis, one rotation being 24 hours, one day. If we look closely at the Earth, we can actually see that it's tilted by 23 and a half degrees, to be precise. And that means, as it orbits the Sun, it alters the way it faces it. Now, as the Earth continues its orbit around the Sun, you can see that here, the Northern Hemisphere is facing it. This would be during its summer. We can see the line created by the Sun approaching the UK. This is sunrise, and on June the 21st in the UK, it takes about 16 hours from when it rises to when it sets. It's also worth noting that the Arctic is in sunlight all day, whilst the Antarctic is in darkness all day. Now, if we follow the Earth around to the opposite side of its orbit, we're now in winter in the Northern Hemisphere. It's now tilting away from the sun. If we look at the sunrise and sunset on December the 21st, it now only takes around eight hours. This is the winter solstice, and while it means it's the shortest day, it also means that from now on, as the Earth continues its orbit, the days will start to get longer, and although a long